Hello everybody, Fishmon14, here with more Let's Play, The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, and in this video, I'm going to tackle the first dungeon. What say you we get started on that? Now, this isn't just a... Your normal Zelda game would just have you going through the dungeon, but as you can see, there's stray fairies here. Or, there's a stray fairy. There's actually, a, I believe, a total of 15 in every dungeon. So that's sort of a side thing that we've got to be paying attention to while we're doing dungeons. Not only, if you recall, the great fairy said that the mask will shimmer, but not only does it do that, if there are great fairies in the open, they'll come to you. But only if they're in the open. They, they could be in the room, but trapped in some way. Um, let's see here. I'll wait till I get over there, because I think there's one in that beehive. But, you know, it would be kind of frustrating to find them if if it weren't for the shimmering thing, because, they, you know, if you're, like, up to 14, you need one more, it could be anywhere in the dungeon. Well, that's why it shimmers. It lets you know if, you know, if you're in the room. It, if they're in a different room, it won't shimmer. Can't see down there. Okay. There would have been a sound effect like doo 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 if there was one. Okay, it was just five rupees. Five rupees. There's one in this chest, I believe. They're really easy to find in this first dungeon. They get progressively more difficult, as you would assume. But I, I wouldn't consider them any sort of challenge until the second dungeon. Well, I mean, you gotta be looking for them, you're not gonna just run into them in this dungeon, but if you're looking for them, it's still not gonna be hard. Uh, there aren't any more in this dungeon, are there? I mean, in this room. Nope. Alrighty, let's see here. Ugh, that stench! This place stinks just like that poison swamp. <laughs> That's because it's poison couldn't tell by the purple water, and the fact that she said, like the poison swamp, which kind of implies that it's probably poison. Oh, okay. Yeah, sometimes enemies hold stray fairies. Sometimes they'll be in bubbles. I think there's one in a bubble in this room. Yep, right there. Sometimes they'll... Well, I don't know. Let's just look around here. Oh, I think I know where the first key is. Hmm... <laughs> Yeah, I sort of remember all this stuff because I was just doing this dungeon less than a week ago. And it's because, like I said in, I think, the last video, I I was doing a... I was actually doing a speedrun of this game, which was last week. But it doesn't really count because I've never... It's probably really the first real speedrun I've ever done. And I didn't, like, practice the game in any sort of way. I think my stopping point was I was in, like, the Pirate's Fortress. And it was like four hours and twelve minutes, so it's not the greatest, but I mean, I was still kind of figuring out stuff. <clears throat> but I wasn't going for the stray fairies or anything. But I, I was getting some pieces of heart here and there. Just, just like, so I would hopefully not die at later points. Oh, I believe there's actually a great, not great fairy, a, a stray fairy right here. No! Oh, and, like, I was trying to remember what I was saying for a second. Um, I wouldn't really consider, no matter what my time is, I don't consider, I won't consider the speedrun valid, because, uh, wait, oh, no sparkles, okay. Couldn't tell because that fairy was still leaving sparkles behind. Um, because I was doing the GameCube version of the game, and that, that version, ugh, it stutters like crazy, and the only reason I was doing that is because I was... I was at somebody else's house, so I didn't have access to either my N64 or the Wii version here. So it runs at like, probably like 80% of the speed or something. Sometimes it would just slow to an absolute crawl. So whatever my time is, doesn't, it's not, it, it would be better if I were using a valid version of the game. Or not a valid version, but you know, like one that doesn't suck. Really, I should have waited to do my speed run, but I just really, really felt like it while I was there. 
this is gonna net us the map. No, oh, so I don't think I've even mentioned yet that this is Woodfall Temple. I mean, I, me I mentioned it was the worst, the, the worst, the first temple, and that it probably said it when I walked in. But this is actually a pretty cool dungeon. I actually really like the music here. Well, actually, I really like the music of all four dungeon this dungeons in this game. I probably like the music of all four of these dungeons better individually better than all of the dungeons in Ocarina of Time, except maybe the Spirit Temple. Spirit Temple has really awesome music. And maybe the Forest Temple. Possibly the Water Temple, and, I don't know, Shadow Temple? Whatever. I don't know, it's not like it matters. Um, let's see. Well, this looks pretty light. Indeed, it does. Except that's actually going to pose a problem because there's... Ugh, stray fairy down there. I think there's actually a stray fairy inside this skull chore, too. It feels weird to be saying skull and not talking about gold skull chulas. This is Majora's Mask, though. Oh, crap. Don't die. I can't swap to... Digu Link. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I'm fine. Why'd you have to go and knock me in there like that? There may be one in this right here. Should probably wait until I get the dungeon item before I start trying to shoot down these beehives. Oh crap, it was a bee. A bee and a beehive? What the heck? You never know what this game's gonna throw at you. Okay, there's a straight fairy. Come on, do your worst. Ow! I mean, actually do your worst, not your best. But. Okay, and as you can see, there's a stray fairy below there, but she can't actually get to us right now. Um, let's see. Well, maybe she could. Where is she supposed to come from? Ah! Oh, actually, I can't even deal with her right now anyway. I think I'm actually going to have to leave and come back here. I think I actually should have probably done it this way from the start anyway. Because I have to clear a path for me to run through. And this this way is just too long. I do have Deku sticks, right? I might I might not. Okay, I've got seven. That's That's definitely plenty. Oh no, it's almost... it's almost morning. Not that that matters. Oops. Ugh. Oof. Ah. There we go. Careful about these butterflies. They follow the fire, source of light, and... As, you know, as, as scary as butterflies are, they actually do damage in this. They will hurt you. They're like monster butterflies or something. And that opens the way to there. What's in here, by the way? Yeah, okay. May as well do this now. Save a tad of time. <sighs> Otherwise, I would have had to go that... Go, like, continue and then come back to here. Come on. Come on, buddy. I'm not your buddy guy. I'm not your guy friend. I'm not your friend, buddy. This will probably be what the compass. I think I already got the map. I don't recall. I did get the other chest, right? I'll need to check. <laughs> yep, there's the compass. Yep, I've got the map. And how many fairies? Seven. Oops. Yep. Alrighty then. Oh, the butterflies are back over there. Still, they'll probably be chasing me. I think I can see them. <laughs> like, coming this way, they went through the floor. And... <laughs> ow, don't. Oh, I said ow before they even hit me. <laughs> There's not any stray fairies in that jar, are there? Are there? Are there? Goodness. 
It's not that I couldn't speak, it's that my throat did that random thing where it just randomly stops. Like, stops anything from happening for just a moment. Like one drop of spittle gets stuck in your throat and your throat will think you're choking or something. And it's just like, oh. <laughs> Never mind. We're not choking, you're good. Go ahead and go ahead and continue your commentary. Be careful, I sense a lot of evil here. Ah, evil oh. oh my god, stop doing that, throat. I'm trying to commentate here. For my millions and millions of subscribers, and by that I mean 72. Should have gone the other way. Oh, well, at least I can see this time. When I was trying to do the speedrun, this was horrible, because... I had to deal with one of those cables that's like the old kind, like the twisty kind you gotta plug into the back of the television. It produces awful quality. Now, not only do I... I mean, I would have loved to have had the red, white, and yellow cables, but right now I've even got components, so huzzah for that. Uh, there weren't any in that room, were there? I feel like I may have missed... Oh, there are! Somewhere. Supposed to be a oh, I think I'm supposed to kill these things. I thought that they infinitely respond, but I guess they probably don't. I think they do respawn, like some happen that others didn't. If that makes any sense, but I I think there's a limited number. No, I guess they don't. I know there's some more of you around here somewhere. I mean I see you. Don't you see me? I mean, you have evil eyes. Come on. Thank you. I mean, he could see me from that far away. Why couldn't you see me when I was right there? There we go. It's a good thing I came back and checked. But while I'm at it, let me, let me make sure there weren't any in that previous room. Yep. Of course that does it here. I mean, what else would there be to do? Man, I just love this music so much. Oh, there is something in here. I think there's probably... Oh, oh, that's what... Never mind. Yeah, I planned on doing this later. What am I thinking? And watch there be yet another one in there. I like that the room is bright, but then it just randomly goes dark. Way to throw me out of my immersion here, Nintendo. Gosh! Oh, cool, there's nothing in here. Stray fairy-wise, I mean. Careful in this room. See those holes in the floor? Those will actually take you to the original, like, central room that had that giant flower in it. At least I think. I'm not gonna check. Maybe I can actually see down there. He's too far away. Oh, no, he's not. He's coming over. Coming over to part. Oh, the other one's there too. I can see a shadow. That's not on the platform. Way to throw me out of the immersion again, Nintendo. Gosh. Don't you know how to develop a video game? Sheesh. Everybody's a critic, right? This may be not very good. Uh, okay. Wow, that was actually really good. It's probably the best I've ever done that. Across the platforms, I mean. Oh, wow, an, inv an, an invisible wall. You will, Nintendo, you will stop at nothing to just destroy my immersion in this game, will you?